morning. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Petworth. Uh, I am uh, just delighted to be here to get started with Ali Palooza number six. Let me start uh, by congratulating the the newest member of my cabinet, Jeff Marudian. Uh, I have appointed him to be the director of DDOT. I want to thank Jeff for his leadership. He's no stranger to DDOT. Uh, he served previously. He served with a, just tr an excellent tenure in the Obama administration in the U.S. Department of Transportation. Uh, and now we have the great benefit of his expertise here. Uh, let me also welcome and thank all of the Ward 4 residents who have joined us. Let's hear it for Ward 4. And Councilmember Brandon Todd, and I see Commissioner Cooper and all the commissioners of ANC4C. Give them a big round of applause. So we are here uh, as another installment on our down payment uh, to rebuilding our infrastructure and doing it in our neighborhoods. Uh, for the last uh, almost three years, we have had a, a focus on how we change our alleys. I like to tell the story of when I first became council member 10 years ago, I asked the then DDOT director, how long will it take for us to get through our backlog of alleys? At this rate, how long will it take? And he said, 40 years. And he wasn't joking. Uh, so I knew that if I had the opportunity, I would have a focused initiative on transforming alleys across the city. And that's how we uh, came up with Alley Palooza. Uh, the last uh, former director, Leif Dormstro, and I were sitting in my office one summer. And I said, Leif, why don't we come up summertime? We can do a lot of alleys. I said, how many can you do? You think you can do eight in every ward in eight weeks, because that's how long we had in the construction season left. And he said, absolutely. And the DDOT team did it. Uh, and they did it with time to spare, which meant they could do a second round of 64 alleys in that first year. And so that's why in three years, we're now talking about two alley paloozas a year, uh, 64 alleys at a time. That's eight in each ward. So we've already almost done 400 alleys in alley palooza. <laughs> So we know that our residents uh, use alleys to access their parking, their yards. Our staff uses it to get to the trash. Our public safety agencies use it to help people who are having an emergency. So it is important how we maintain our alleys. It's also important to keep alleys clean. And that's where we need your help. Uh, we need to remind neighbors of their responsibility about 12, 18 or 12 inches from their property line to keep that clean, to make sure that we are using our trash cans appropriately, that we have enough trash cans and that we're reminding neighbors to use them appropriately, that we are reducing our waste, that we're recycling where appropriate. Uh, so that brings me to my next announcement. Uh, we have a new staff member joining us who will will be the city's director of Clean City, and her name is Julie Lawson. And Julie, welcome. Julie will join us from Trash Free Maryland, and she is going to help make us a Trash Free D.C., uh, and she's a Ward 4 resident. So join me in welcoming Julie. So let me turn it over uh, to, count, uh, to Jeff Marudian, and then we're going to hear from Councilmember Todd, and Jeff is going to talk about the details of this alley makeover. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Thank you, Mayor Bowser, uh, for the kind introduction and also for being here with us to kick off Alley Palooza 6. Uh, and thank you for the opportunity to serve as the DDOT director uh, and to continue to be a part of your administration. Uh, it is a true honor to be a part of DDOT. Uh, I felt that way when I first joined the agency in 2008. Uh, I felt that way when I rejoined uh, back in February. Uh, and I feel that way today. Uh, we have a great team and our staff, uh, several of whom are here uh, with us today, uh, are truly committed to making sure that the district has the strongest, most robust infrastructure and transportation network possible. They inspire me and I am excited about the opportunities that we have ahead uh, to work together to strengthen our city uh, even more. So now on to the excitement, launching today's Alley Palooza campaign. Uh, keeping our infrastructure in a state of good repair uh, enhances the safety and quality of life for all of our residents across all eight wards of the city. And alleys are a critical part of that infrastructure. 
The district has more than 350 miles of alleys, uh, and for many of us, alleys are often the first thing that we see when we walk out of our doors in the morning. So we are at DDOT are doing all that we can to make sure that that first step out the door uh, is great. And as the mayor mentioned, we have repaired an unprecedented amount of alleys so far since she launched, launched the first Alley Palooza campaign in 2015, almost 400. On average, we receive about 1,000 calls for service, alley-related re service requests, a year. And while some of those are duplicates uh, for the same alley, we sift through every single one and log each one, each and every request. Uh, and as evidenced by uh, our, uh, our effort here today, we respond. So thank you to each of you. Uh, who take the time to send us information, to send us service requests, uh, and to let us know where we are needed. Uh, I want to thank all of our colleagues, our partner agencies, uh, especially the men and women of DDOT who do the design, the construction, the maintenance work uh, of all of our infrastructure across the city. Uh, and now let's get this thing going. Uh, we're on to Alley Palooza 6, and we're going to keep going. Our goal is to complete 64 alleys, as the mayor said, uh, in the next 12 weeks. And Mayor Bowser, I say with the utmost confidence, we are ready for that challenge. Uh, and it's now my pleasure to introduce Councilmember Brandon Todd. All righty. Well, good morning, everyone, and good morning, Mayor Bowser and Director Maruti. And I couldn't be more thrilled to, than to join the residents of Ward 4 and the District Department of Transportation to kick off Alley Palooza Number 6. Uh, as the mayor said, a clean and safe alley really means a clean and safe ward and a clean and safe city. And so I'm already looking forward to Alley Palooza Number 7. Uh, and we'll. We're looking very much forward to it. But thank you to the neighbors that are here. The people have been patient uh, and diligent in working with us and, and the Department of Transportation uh, in waiting for this day. So congratulations to the neighbors here. Congratulations to you, Mayor uh, and Director, on your sixth Alley Palooza. And let's get ready for number seven. Thank you. And let me just also mention that to come, um, we will be talking about our Amped Up Local Roads program. And one of the Jeff's first tasks are, is to package our increase in spending and activity on our local roads. Uh, the truth is our main roads are in pretty good shape, um, but the local residential streets, too many of them are rated in poor condition. Um, so we will be talking to you in the coming weeks about our local roads program. I'll take any questions. Press questions first. Okay, any questions? Any community questions? I don't have a question, but I yes. just want to thank you so much because I live in that house. Okay. And I had to go through there. Yes. And I don't have to anymore. All right, thank good. All right. Well, I'm happy to hear that. That's fantastic. And let me just quickly introduce Jasmine and Philip, who probably need no introduction here. Um, and they are the Ward 4 Mokers. Uh, they represent the Mayor's Office of Community Relations, which means they represent me uh, in Ward 4. And they uh, are doing a fantastic job and are very responsive and are getting a lot of work done. So thank you to Jasmine and Philip. Thank you, everybody. And I want to thank all of the DDOT team before we finish, because they are doing an incredible job with Alley Palooza. And we're looking forward to the job they do on local roads. And I'm not going to call it Palooza, but it's going to be something fantastic. All right. Thank you.